what is up squad today we're back with another video oh <laughs> but today we're going to be talking about how to uh, as you read by the title how to keep cool this summer i can already tell this summer is going to be really 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 hot like i'm talking 100 degrees hot not just because of global warming i mean like well, maybe because, probably because global warming, but I just feel like this is going to be a hot summer. This is, is going to be crazy hot. Um, we already, ex we are already experiencing like 90 degree weather already, 80 degree, 70 degree, whatever you want to call it. Mostly between 80s and 90s. And I want to let you know, if you're in that hot, hot weather, I want to let you know how to keep cool this summer. So let's get on with this video. Number one is keeping hydrated water, people. Not juice, not soda, not any other thing you drink besides water. You need water because nothing quenches your thirst like water. And if you don't drink water in the summer, you can experience um, heat stroke. And heat stroke is not a joke. It's not a game. You can, I'm going to put the symptoms over here, but, um, when you, um, experience heat stroke, you get high body temperature, altered metal state or behavior, um, uh, what's it call it? Sweating, vomiting, flushed skin, rapid breathing, racing heart rate and a headache and also if you have and also heat exhaustion you'll be confused dark dark um color urine <laughs> um dizziness fainting headaches muscle and uh abominable cramps I, I always get twisted up with like words like that and vomiting and yeah but um, make sure you stay hydrated in the summer because you don't want to experience any of those. I've never experienced them, but just from those symptoms, it sounds scary. But yeah, make sure you keep hydrated. First of all, you need water in your life. Second of all, it keeps you cool. And third of all, it is so refreshing during the summer. Just a taste of that sweet, sweet, sweet water will just... It takes it tastes sweet, especially in summer because you're gonna be so exhausted and stuff. So like if you if well, let's say you're crying or you're sweating a lot, make sure you drink water because when you release water out of your body, you need to put it back in because of course you're made of mostly water. So make sure to stay hydrated during summer. Number two, make sure you always have icy popsicles or ice cream at hand. That is just, it's like water, but like less. Like I feel like water's more like for refreshing, but icy in summer is just like the best. Like you know the bomb pops that you can get from the ice cream truck or like anything like that. It's just so refreshing to have in the summer. Just that sweet, nice, drippy juice Mm, in your mouth that's so good like an icy is just what you need in the summer to keep cool and it's 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 good it tastes good um if you don't like ices there's always ice cream and you make an icy sun i mean the ice cream sundae there's always that like you can do there's endless possibilities with ices and ice cream number three Go outside in the sprinkler. I know you're like, I don't want to go outside. That's boring. I feel you. Sometimes I feel you. But look, most of the time, like now, I've been going outside more because there's nothing else better to do. You're not going to sit on your iPad all day. You're not going to sit on your computer all day because it's going to get boring. Sometimes I get bored of YouTube and Minecraft and Netflix. Sometimes I just want to do something else because when you do it too much, it just gets boring. But yeah, um, go outside and play in your sprinkler because it is so fun. Make up your own game. You There's like literally endless possibilities. You're in a sprinkler. You're in the sprinkler, people. You can make your own sprinkler at home. Just hook the sprinkler thing up to the hose. If you don't have it, they're probably cheap. I don't know. Look it up. <laughs> Amazon. But yeah, you can hook it up to your hose and then turn it on. It can water your grass, wash your car, and you can play in it. So like that's just like a... That's a three package deal. So like just go play in the sprinkler. It's easy, it's fun, and it's just refreshing. Just go do it. Okay, go do it. If you're if you're hot like me. 
tip number four, I'm gonna like put these two together because um, I it's, it's more tips for you guys. Like you don't, I don't even have to explain it because it's more tips for you guys. Ice packs and um, cold showers. I know you're like cold showers, my mortal enemy. Well, you might like taking cold showers. I don't, I don't know. But in summer, I love, 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 love taking cold showers. They're so refreshing, so cool, and they're just like an escape, you know, from like that heat. And also, and ice. You can, I like to put ice in my mouth because it just cools me down, cools my whole body down. I just like keep it in my mouth for a while and just like, I just love eating ice. It's it's an it's an addiction. Don't judge me, okay? Um, but yeah, um, if you don't like um, eating it, you can just put it bod over your body if you're hot in a certain place. It does the job, okay, people? It does the job, okay? Now we're gonna go on to the next tip. Tip number five: Go in your basement. I don't know what it is. It's a secret. It's like an unknown meaning. Well, to me, I don't know. You might know why, but go in your basement i don't know what it is about basements like i said they're just cool um if you don't have a basement these are for the people that do have a basement but like if you if your basement like my, my my basement has internet i'd be chilling down there if it's really if, re if it really gets hot because i don't know what it is again but basements are cooler than the upstairs so if you're really hot if you're desperate go in your basement go chillax and tell me how you feel okay Tip number six. We're getting close, people. We're getting close. Um, go in your shade. If you don't have shade, uh, go get some, okay? But um, if you you probably have the shade from a house, a shade from a tree, and if you don't have that, you can get one of those little tables that have the umbrella at the top. That can shade you. And if you don't have that, again, like I said, go find some shade, okay? Um, go to the park and or like go, I don't know, go somewhere and find shade, okay? But just chillax in the shade. There's no harm chilling in the shade. Like it's gonna be fine. <laughs> but yeah, go sit in the shade. Have yourself some water and icy and all of the other things I said, and go get your cool summer. Tip number seven, the last tip, eat um, fruits that have a lot of water in them. Like such as, that That makes no sense, I don't know. Well, well it kind of makes sense, but it's like not, whatever. Um, like eat things like watermelon, water melon cantaloupe i personally don't like cantaloupe but if you're into that eat it and cucumbers those have so much water in them like it's basically made up the water like and some other things of course but yeah eat those things this is kind of like the first one but i really want to include this in because it's really important and watermelon is just like this the significant food of the summer um i i I don't know how to feel about it. I like watermelon, but the thing is, sometimes I don't like it because sometimes it has this weird taste if it has like too much sugar in it. Or not, of course, like that has natural sugar, but it just tastes weird sometimes, and I'm like, I'm not into that. But I, and I usually like, like, you know, so this is the watermelon, right? The, and I don't really like the top because it's too mushy and stuff. I like near the rims. I, I don't, I'm so weird, I know. But I like hard watermelon. I don't know. It's just it's something about it, you know? And I personally like mangoes better than watermelon. Comment down below if you like mangoes better than watermelon. Because mangoes is just on fleek. But yeah, eat those foods. So everyone, I hope you guys like this video of me explaining to you how to be cool, tips on being cool, how to be cool, period. <laughs> but yeah, I hope this video really helped you because I know, I just feel, I can feel it guys, this is going to be in hot summer. And, I mean like, if you're in one of the cooler parts of the world, you good, you good, you're good. <laughs> but if, if you're like in one of the hotter places, you're definitely gonna need these tips because I, I have spilled the tea for you guys. You guys better have got your cups ready because I definitely spilled some tea. But it, it's really too hot for tea. I, 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 I spilled the lemonade. <laughs> but yeah, hope you guys like this video. Give it a big, 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 big thumbs 
that was way too much. I don't know where that came from. But make sure to give this a big thumbs up and subscribe and turn on this notification so you don't miss any upload and so you're not that person that looks back at my channel and says she already has 10 videos uploaded oh my gosh how did i miss this turn on your notifications <laughs> but yeah guys peace